so this is the second discussion on integrations let me just bother how integration differs from differentiation in differentiation we had bothered that <coughs> if e to the power x dx is e to the power x then the x can become anything what we say to be the star and once it's becoming a star it will get multiplied by the star now in integration the star is not simply anything the star can at best be ax plus b or in other words the star is only ax plus b so <coughs> if integration of e to the power x is e to the power x integration of star is integration of star plus c is the formality so when it is x it is x when it is star it is star only thing is it will get divided by a or in other words whenever the x becomes ax plus b the answer will be ax plus b divided by a plus c so this is what i'm saying to be the star in any formula on different on integration the x can become ax plus b and can replace any x so but the thing is it will get divided by a <coughs> so what are a and b these are basically constants or simple numbers like 1 2 3 4 5 and so on let's go with the problem so you can understand better let me say integration of e to the power 2x plus 5 is how much so <coughs> here I go integration of e to the power x is e to the power x integration of e to the power ax plus b is e to the power ax plus b divided by a plus c so this is your a this is your b so the answer is e to the power 2x plus 5 divided by 2 so the limitation of integration is e to the power x <coughs> and e to the power ax plus b are only having direct formulae or we can do so if it is by chance e to the power x square many students write like e to the power x square this is wrong because as i told the star is only ax plus b is only ax plus b i repeat so e to the power ax square is x uh, e to the power x square is not e to the power x square because x square is not like ax plus b or in other words x square is not looking like ax plus b so <coughs> similarly e to the power root x is not e to the power root x trust me whenever it's exactly like ax plus b then only you should use the formula otherwise not so how to integrate things which are not in the x plus b form for example e to the power sine of x square and so on this is a this one's differentiation you can get sine of x square this is a star in differentiation but not in integration <coughs> the thing is many questions are not integrable you can't integrate simply anything so the questions that will be given to you on integration are really very much limited very few questions are there in integration others are not yet done in mathematics so what is the ax plus b how it may look ax plus b will look like this may look like this 2x plus 3 2x minus 3 it may be minus 2x plus 3 it may be minus 2x minus 3 and so on so this is a this is b this is a this minus 3 is the b because 2x minus 3 can be written like 2x plus of minus 3 so this is a this is b this is minus 2 into x plus 3 so this is your a minus 2 b is 3 this is minus 2 into x plus of minus 3 so this is your a this is your b it may also look like this simply 2x so this is 2 into x 
nothing is there means 0 is there so this is your b it can look like this simply minus x so this is minus 1 into x plus 0 it may look like <coughs> 2 by 3 into x plus 7 by 9 because this is your a this is your b a and b are any kind of real numbers any any form of numbers what we say as constants in maths so after this I believe now you can do the last two questions here it is e to the power 2x this is up to 83 so e to the power 2x how to do integration of e to the power 2x dx so this is integration of e to the power 2x plus 0 dx definitely it's in the form of ax plus b so integration of e to the power ax plus b is e to the power ax plus b divided by a so this is e to the power 2x plus 0 divided by 2 plus c or in other words simply you can just think of in your mind for a second you can get it like e to the power 2x by 2 plus c so because 2x plus 0 is 2x by 2 is the same thing I'm writing similarly e to the power minus x plus c is I'm sorry integration of e to the power minus x is e to the power minus 1 into x plus 0 so that way it's e to the power minus 1 into x divided by minus 1 so this is e to the power minus x by minus 1 plus c or it is simply minus e to the power minus x plus c so <coughs> it can be simply anything any x can become x plus b and nothing else integration of sin x sin 2x so sin x was minus cos x so it will be minus cos 2x divided by 2 plus c doesn't matter if it is a plus 3 it will be a plus 3 because the b doesn't get divided in the denominator it's just getting, getting copy pasted what is getting divided is the coefficient of x that is what we said with the a one by e to the power x integration of one by e to the power x dx it's nothing but e to the power minus x dx so this is my e to the power minus x by minus one plus c so this is minus e to the power minus x plus c it can be asked <coughs> like e to the power x square if it is I'm sorry if it is 1 by e to the power 2x it will be e to the power minus 2x so you can make out it's minus 2x by minus 2 plus c this is a join me in the next discussion so that you can do integration more comfortably